Welcome to our first uh, review video. Uh, uh, what's going to be today is we are going to make a little bit review about a movie uh, titled The Wrong Cut Story. You walk away, you stay away. I can start right now. Inside one of New York City's worst classrooms. Last year, this class went through six different teachers before Christmas. I specialize in raising standardized test scores. One man has come to make a difference. Nobody wants them, and I do, so what's the problem? They said he couldn't teach them. Go ahead, suspend me. I want to leave. Hey, look, the fool's leaving already. Sit down. They said he couldn't control them. These kids are at the bottom of the barrel. You see this? This means that this year is going to be different. So stupid. Whoa. These kids can do anything I'm asking them to do more. They just won't. What, you feel helpless? My school, my rules, my way. They feel that way every day. You piece of garbage. But when no one else wanted them, Ron Clark gave them the hope. Where am I going to go now, Mr. Clark? I'm going to help you. And the courage. We are climbing up and up and up, and now it's time to jump. To accomplish the impossible. There's no way we're going to pass those tests. Everyone thinks we're losers, Mr. Clark. You are not losers. I can't work on my paper right now. I gotta go make dinner. I'll do it. You'll do what? I'll make dinner and you work on your paper. The inspiring true story. Why are you doing this? You gave her these grand ideas and this world's just gonna crush her down. If she tests well enough in May, I think we might be able to get her into Manhattan West. My Shamika. Yes. That's for gifted kids. Of one man's passion. Everything we do in this room is personal. How we work together and how we've prepared for these tests. To change the rules. You are setting the bar here. Why? Set it up here. They can make it. And inspire the children. Starring Matthew Perry. And if you trust me, you can learn more than you ever dreamed of. Ernie Hudson. Do you really think it appropriate to do this with the students? Well, I'm certainly not going to double dutch with you. <laughs> and some of the most amazing kids you've ever seen. I teach you, and you teach me. And together we learn to love to learn. So, before we go to what we have learned in the movie, so first I will talk a bit about the summary of that. So, the story is basically based on a true story about a successful teacher somewhere in North Carolina, and his name is Ron Clark. Uh, back in his hometown, the community they give their respect to him. Uh, however, he then felt like it is time for him to follow his dream, which is to help students who need him more. So, by following his inner feeling, he moved to New York City and teach students from the worst left behind class there in New York City. Throughout the way, he faced a lot of challenges before he managed to turn around the students. Next, we have the value section. So, based on the movie, the first value that I learned is respect. Uh, we should respect each other no matter who the person is. Uh, it is because respect builds a strong bond between humans, which is important for humans to create a bond to each other. In our life, do respect family, friends, and others so that we could live happily. Moving to the next point, we have to give support to each other. Uh, like back in the movie, we could see the elders didn't give support to the back class students because of the level. That is wrong, guys. As an elder, we should help the kid to be on the correct track, bring them 
towards success, not letting them stray too far. Okay, the third one, and last one for me, uh, we have to acknowledge others. Basically, people make something with hope that people appreciate what they did, right? Acknowledge this hard work, so uh, don't look down on someone that's gonna do something. Well, because they surely have something they're expert on. God creates human equally. For my point, and what I uh, what I've learned from the movie is that we should never give up in achieving our dream. Uh, nothing is more matter in our life than to achieve our dream. Uh, having a good career, having a happy family, being a good person, and even to have a God's blessing. That's part of your goals or dream in life. So, we only live once. Uh, why not we just grab it? Don't, don't let the challenges stop you from achieving your dream. Right. Uh, besides that, I also learned that we should not judge people by their looks. <laughs> Sometimes, one's true value isn't portrayed by their outer look. Judging outer look will lead to uh, misjudge and even could make people lose respect to each other. So we, we have to avoid misjudge people. And to avoid this, why don't we know that person deeper before we judge them? Yeah, that, I think that's one better way. So uh, my final point for the value is that we should love and care each other. <clears throat> As a human being, none of us could live happy without other people around. So everybody seeks for love and care from others. So before we want people to love us, to care about us, why don't we start to love and care about other people first? Uh, just like in the movie, you can see that at first the students just didn't care about their teachers. They can, uh, they mostly most of them hate the teachers. So if not wrong club start to care about and love them first, I don't think the kid will just them like uh, wrong club. Yeah, we start first and before other give them what we want. So, that's all from us for now. For those who didn't watch the Long Club story yet, go and watch it now. It's a really good movie and you will never regret it. Okay, that's all from us. Bye. Bye.